Hello again, I'm Tyler Smith with Battleship Pretension, and this is Tyler's Movie Journal. So today we're, uh, the Oscar nominations were announced, and so for the next several days, uh, even the next few weeks, uh, I'm going to be talking about films that are available to you right now that were nominated or uh, won some Oscars. So today I'm going to be talking about uh, a personal favorite of mine. It is Sidney Lumet's The Verdict, which came out in 1982. It stars Paul Newman, uh, James Mason, Jack Warden, and it's a really... Okay, so let me, I'll, I'll I'll spell this out. So it's it is uh, Sidney Lumet directing a script by David Mamet, and it stars Paul Newman. Like, really, let that sink in. That that was a film that existed, and and unfortunately, a lot of people don't know about it, and uh, that is sad because I think it is a lot of the uh, a lot of the artists involved at, at the top of their game. Um, I know that it is for many people. Uh, the, their favorite Paul Newman performance, and that is saying something. Uh, he plays a lawyer in Boston who is drunk, he's pretty corrupt, um, and is just an ambulance chaser. And then he runs across a case that he actually already has, but hasn't been paying attention to. And uh, there's it's a potential moneymaker uh, in which a young couple is, is suing a hospital. And so as he starts to delve into the case, he goes about it the way he usually does, which is try to settle out of court. It doesn't really matter if the the party that has done something wrong admits to doing something wrong. It's just about getting paid and then moving on to the next case. Uh, But the more he gets involved in this case, the more he starts to believe in it and the more he starts to believe in himself. But he is his own worst enemy as well. And so it's a really complex performance by uh, Paul Newman, but there's some really wonderful performances uh, as well. It was nominated for uh, Best Picture, Director, Actor for Paul Newman, Supporting Actor for James Mason, who plays one of my favorite types of characters, which is the opposing counsel, uh, whether it be George C. Scott in Anatomy of a Murder or Robert Duvall in A Civil Action or James Mason in The Verdict. I love the character of the opposing counsel, um, and James Mason does a great job with it by not overplaying the the evil of the character he is cunning he is smart he might be willing to cut corners but he's not necessarily an evil guy and he doesn't even represent an evil company it's just people trying to to cover their own ass so uh it was also nominated for adapted screenplay uh it didn't win any of these unfortunately uh, it lost all of that stuff to uh to gandhi except for supporting actor uh, which is a perfectly fine film, but I, I think I – and it's, it's probably a bigger achievement, Gandhi, but The Verdict is a film that when you watch it, you'll be engrossed by it. Uh, I think a, a good uh, modern equivalent would probably be Michael Clayton. It reminds me a lot of Michael Clayton. So if you enjoy that film and you enjoy the work of Sidney Lumet or David Mamet or Paul Newman or any of these other people, uh, I highly recommend it. It is available streaming now. The Verdict, check it out.